Height connected pipes. Ooh. Oh, wow. Look at that. Is that all the pipes hidden? That is awesome. Oh, man. That is so cool. Okay, he's dead. Now. Oh, balls. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is Games for Cakes and welcome back to Ag Aberration on the other guy's server. We are today going to take it a little bit chill and we're going to start looking at making a greenhouse. Now, I don't know exactly where I want it. I think, like I said before, where I mentioned it, I have seen other YouTubers do it kind of at the side of their base and I'm thinking I want to kind of have it compact within this base, kind of higher up. Because if we build further out, the problem is that we will stop resources from spawning and I don't want my metal node to disappear down there. So I don't want to build something too close to the water. Now we're gonna have to lay pipes all the way from the water up to this base because we just don't have a way around it. Now we have these water tanks that we can write and for some reason, even though it's not raining, they do fill up. I suppose the earthquake may be simulating the rain or whatnot, but either way, we're going to try to get a greenhouse to work with a couple of big plots because we also want to get the plant species C or whatever it is, the, the one thing we found this one here, plant species C seed, we want to start growing that as well. Anyway, I hope you guys are gonna have a good time watching the episode. If you do, remember to kick that like button in the box to support the channel. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. So let's get started. Now, again, there's a lot of things that can happen this episode. Like the main thing that we're gonna focus on is the greenhouse. But if I spot a crab down there or whatnot, we're actually going to start uh, a look trying to tame that crab as well. We need to get a couple of resources. I'm actually nearly out of stone. Like I just collected a couple of thousand flint and um, now we're just gonna have to get a couple of thousand stone. Um, I would feel good if we can make it about 10,000 or something. That would be pretty epic. Oh, we're nearly full. There we go, nice. Okay, that's gone as well. And we can't reach that, no. Oh, we can't, oh, we can just about move. No, here's the poop. No, he's not rolling. Can we make it to the next stone? That would be absolutely epic. There we go, nice. And another thousand stone. Sweet. Okay, so let's just transfer all that. And then um, we're going to get another couple of uh, loads. And then we should be okay. So we have flint. We, I just went thatch with scared root. I did the flint manually by myself. Because I don't think there's actually any animal that collects flint. And then we, I think, have everything. Fiber, we have a couple of thousand. So we should be okay. Yeah, and then I think we can start looking at... Um, Making the whole area for the greenhouse. Metal gear, there we go. Excellent, so that was 4,400. Yeah, I get another couple of thousand and then we should be okay. So I think this is the approximate length or width or whichever. I don't know yet if it's going to be the width or length. But I want to go about two out here and I want to have one walk platform space between it. So if we look at this... This is where I want the actual greenhouse to start. Like on this one, not this one. So from here around, so these two blocks, so these blocks are all just to walk around. Now these two blocks here are gonna be the first start, the first start all the way around here to these two blocks. So this is just to walk around. So that way we can walk all the way around the greenhouse, maybe have two doors, you know, like as an entrance or whichever. I don't know yet. Now, if we take a plot, let's see where we actually do the plot. Um, large crop, plot, yeah, we're only gonna plant large ones. The medium ones are probably pointless because I think everything that we can put into the small one, we can put in the large one, but not everything we can put in the large one, we can put in the medium one. So let's just make five of those. Well, I, I would like to have six in total, at least in my greenhouse so let's see actually how big they look okay so they actually just all oh, right okay that makes sense okay so if we have them here and then another one here okay that would make sense and then I suppose we're gonna have the walls of the greenhouse go right here. That's another thing. I actually don't know. Greenhouse. Let me see. Greenhouse. Ooh, where do I craft the greenhouse walls? Probably in the smithy, is it? Yes. So greenhouse walls. 
Is there diff- different type of walls? Greenhouse door, greenhouse door frame. Okay, that's fair enough. Greenhouse door window. What? A greenhouse window? Why would you have a greenhouse window? <laughs> okay, let's see. Greenhouse wall. Yes. Okay, so let's let's craft one of those. Oh, they're actually 25 crystals. Now, we have a lot of crystals actually around us. like So I can go and uh, do a session on that. That's no problem. So let's actually quickly go here and see if we can. Oh, that is beautiful. So we can actually do that. Oh, that is nice. So let me see here. We would, no, we would move on to this one. There we go. Oh, this is lovely. I like that. And then maybe we have a door in the middle and then we can have two on either side. That would be pretty boss. That is nice. Oh, I'm loving it. Okay, so now how do we get the irrigation in? The irrigation, I assume we can get from below possibly. And then maybe go through the windows, if that's a thing. So we're gonna have to see the pipes. So if I would like to have the pipes, let's see if I can uh, let's see if I can make any pipes. So irrigation pipes, straight, vertical irrigation stone pipe incline. No, I don't want any incline. I just want a straight pipe. So if we're going to take and make like say two of those, and intake is for the water. And then any of them are going to be connected to whatever. So if we are going to... Oh, we can actually place them wherever we want. That is awesome. So we don't have to worry about walls or anything. That is pretty cool. I like that. So, which means we could theoretically have it even come from the top, above, or from here going up and then into the greenhouse from the top. That would be pretty amazing. I like that. So if we actually do a small pillar, can I put a small, can I put a small pillar here? No, we need a bigger pillar because I want to, I think I should make it at least two pillars high. So if we take, uh, no, that's a large pillar. If we take two small pillars, put them on top of each other, and that will be about the height that I want the pipe to go. And then on either side of the pipe, I want uh, the water thing to trickle down. So that, that would definitely be a thing. I hope I can get this actually right. I have no idea. Okay, we have a problem. We lost Gertrude. And we're gonna have a very high level Ravager there. Level 92, which I'm really interested in. But this one here has to die. The other one over there, hopefully... Okay, he's getting loose now. Okay, let's... Get this guy. Okay. Come on. Come on. Okay, he's dead. Now. Oh, balls. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, come on. Come on. Hold. Hold. Come on. Come on. Ah, your balls. Okay, he's running away. He's running away. Yes. Okay. Come on. Come on. Okay, more another bowler. Come on. 
Nope. Ah, oh, come on! Come on. I hate when you hit him right with the bowler in the face and it doesn't do anything. Come on. Okay, that's it. We're out of we 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 we're in trouble. We're in trouble. Damn it. And that was our last bowler. Oh my god. We have no more bowler. No. Okay, that's it. Very, very terribly done. Terribly done. We lost Gertrude. I, it was just terrible. Absolutely terrible. Revenge is sweet, baby. How much turbo you have got in you? Oh, look at you. There we go. Oh, I can't believe it. Yes! Got a little razor here. Just something I found along the way and tamed because why not? There we go, nice. Okay, baby, you're level 92, but you probably took a bit of a beating. So, ah, I don't have any mutton, that's your favorite. So let's see what we're gonna get from you. Okay, you're gonna be okay. Don't attack anything. There's a scorpion wandering around here as well. We have to be careful. I'm not sure we're gonna manage. Okay, he's taking his time, but still 99.8 effectiveness, 45 levels on top. That is absolutely amazing. Oh man, that would be, what is that? Eight, 37, it's like 137. Oh my God. It's like, oh no, 130, yeah, 137. Genie Mac, if everything goes well. That is amazing. We can put a couple of glow sticks out just so we can snoop out that scorpion if he was going to sneak up on us in the dark, little bastard. Because I can just imagine, he was actually a level 40 something, so still very formidable. Don't want him to like to poke that sting up my ass because that would be really uncomfortable and probably make him go bye bye. And here's that beauty, I took care of the scorpion because he was annoying me, he was kind of lingering around the edges and I didn't like that, so we took care of him. But, you guys can name our male Ravager. Now this guy looks like a beast. He looks, look at that, he scars over the eyes and oh, he's just beautiful. So um, what are we gonna name him? I have no idea. You guys can name him. And if you see another person uh, have, giving it a name in the comments below, just vote that comment up. So that way the most upvoted comment uh, with the name that you guys like, you know, I'm gonna choose, end of story. So it is a, it is a bloke, so it is a Ravager, but if you wanna call it Mary, you're gonna call it Mary, okay? That's up to you guys. And look at that 235 melee damage, or oh, nearly 2000 health. That is beautiful. Loads of food. And stamina, all right, very nice. I like it, nearly a thousand stamina. That is very, very good. I believe that is good because if I look at it with my spike glass, I think it's like 135.6 damage. I think that's good. I'm not really 100% sure. Speed is always seems to be a little bit wasted, I believe. And that's pretty much it. So health 15, I don't know how to read these stats exactly. If there is anywhere a link to a guide, like how to understand these stats properly, uh, let me know because 15, 0, 26, 0, I have no idea what that means. I just assume it means maybe 26 levels after taming went into, sta into strength out of the 45 levels that it's gained. I'm not sure because obviously he was 92 and now he's like 137. So the same goes for this Raptor. He's very, very good in strength, but I don't know exactly what that means. So again, if you have a link or anything like, you know, that I can follow and read up on that, let me know. So I decided to do the pipe system from the reverse. So I have a pipe system that's coming, going up here, going all the way down here. And the good thing is the S plus pipes, you can just hide them so you can say, hide oh sorry you can just hide there you go it's invisible it's still there but you can walk right through it well i suppose you can walk right through it with the other ones as well and uh, that's pretty handy so you can just hide them all in the end uh, to make it look very pretty now i don't know if dinosaurs destroy these that's kind of the only thing i'm a bit worried about 
But um, hopefully not. So we're going to bring them down. I think we might need another incline at that level. So let me just see here. Pipe. Incline. I think maybe one more incline. Yeah, perfect. That's perfectly above the ground. So we're going to get another couple of straights. And then the intake will become there. So we need about, I think, 10 more straights. That's probably what we need. And we need to go a little bit more closer so we can get access to the resources. And let me see here. Pipe. Straight. And I'd say... 10 is probably what we need and we still have all the resources i mean all they really need is stone and we have loads of stone i mean we have we, we have thousands of stone so let's see if we can get that to the water and then put the intake pipe attached to it here we go bam there's another seat there we go nice plant seed now this has water i hope us building that is not going to impact that it shouldn't hopefully not but it's going all the way up here. So the pipe system is laid. It's going all the way here. I remember reading something about the S Plus system that you don't need a water intake pipe for one of the objects. And it will just give you water. It's like the idea is like a well or something, but it's not a well. Where it just basically, it's, I think it's the intake pipe that goes anywhere in the ground. It, do, it doesn't need water, yeah? And the idea of it is basically that you just basically, you have water underground, yeah? Anyway, so now the problem I'm having is that this has water, but I need to actually send it further up. So, no, intake pipe is wrong. So vertical, oh, excellent, it goes up now because before it didn't go up, I wasn't able to build on top, which was quite painful. So what we need now is an incline over here into the window. Let's see if we can do that. Yes, I fell down, thank you very much. Thank you very much, game. A little bit of jiggy wiggy from an earthquake and it's like, okay, can't hold my balance. Whoop de doo. No, I know in reality it's probably very hard like to keep your balance when there's an earthquake, but this is not one of those days. So, oh, we are dehydrating. You are dehydrating, yes. And I didn't get any water. Do we have any water in here? We have 51. Well, that lasts for a little bit. Okay, so let's put the incline in here. Now, hopefully, what I'm hoping is that the pipes can just go through the windows. End of story. And we don't really care. So, let me see. Incline. Go on top. Ah, no, 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 no. Can you not go up? Can you not go up? Ah, why can you not go up? So, this looks very ugly, but it's the only way I could get it done. And we're going to hide all these anyway, so we're not really too fussed about it. You can, we can reach them here. We can just jump up and uh, hide them. Now, they seem to water quite a lot. So, this side here seems to water not only these four, but also these two. But for reasons of, like, just looks, you know, we're going to obviously make them... Um, can we make them invisible as well? Height connected pipes. Ooh. Oh, wow. Look at that. Is that all the pipes hidden? That is awesome. Oh, man. That is so cool. So, ho, ho. So, we can just go here and say show connected pipes. Boom. This is awesome, guys. We're going to so do that in the end. Okay. So, here's some poop, but we have some proper fertilizer. Anyway, um, for looks, we're going to put a tap on this side as well. And um, then we're going to hide all the pipes and just have these guys up here. This is going to be really awesome. Now, let's see how far this actually reaches. Um, we have a couple of more plots. Now, these ones definitely will get waters, watered as well. And there we go. And we come up here and we have another two. There we go. Nice. Now, these ones here, these ones get watered. No? Okay, these ones got watered. This got watered. This is still zero, 600. Come on. Come on. Okay, this one doesn't seem to get watered. 
Okay, not water, not water, not water. Fair enough. So we're gonna put another cross here and then another intersection and then another water plot and that will reach that then as well. So that is actually interesting. So it's like more of a diamond shape that it reaches the water everywhere. Now, um, we are trying to build more ceilings here, but we can't in the moment because we need more support. So we're gonna have to sort that out with more pillars, um, which is straightforward. We're just gonna have to make sure that we build more pillars here. Um, this should probably not be supported, is it? Oh, okay, so this here has support. Very interesting. Let's see actually how far out we're gonna get. No, 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 no. Okay, so I think then underneath here is where we're gonna build the next support pillar. And then we're going to probably have to build another one going across, but we'll see. So pillars, do we have a small, we have a large pillar, very good. There we go. And then we're gonna need another medium pillar. The small pillar just won't do. So we need another medium pillar. There we go. Excellent. And now hopefully we will be able without making more support beams here because only until we are down here can I go across, but I really hope I don't have to. That would be just a pain in the balls. Okay, so let's see. Good. That is good. And nice. Okay. Excellent. Now, what about this? It just will not work. Okay, so we can go here. And we can go here. And we can probably go here. But this one here doesn't seem to work. Okay, we might have to put a support pillar, pillar all the way up here as well. Yeah, I don't think we have a choice. Anyway, so pillar. Then we're going to have another crop. Then we're going to have another wall, and that will be quite a big uh, greenhouse, but I think it will be totally worth it. We might actually put a door here and just have a path here as well, all the way across, and then we're going to have... Um, yeah, we're going to have a path going from here, from the stairs, so we're going to pick these guys up. I don't think we're going to... Um, we're going to have a door here as well, so we're not going to have anything here, which means we're going to have the next one over here there we go very nice and the next one here and here so that's four six so if we want to go a little bit further out we can have six on either side and then we're gonna have the whole big wall full of them with uh, only an entrance door on that side and on this side and that's pretty much it so we're out of crystals again so we can't make any more greenhouse walls I'm gonna have to go and get more crystals. It does take quite a lot of crystals per wall. I think it's something ridiculous, like 25 crystals. But we have crystals nearby, like so we're not really too worried about it. Let me just put that roof on here. Nice. And nice. And then we have the second row here. And then there will be one more row, which we're gonna build charge to here. Nice. Love it. Love it. And one more. Nice, excellent stuff. So now crop plots, we're gonna need... We have eight here, all of them are watered. Look at that, beautiful. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. We have eight here. We're going to have eight, nine, ten. We're gonna have ten over here. That's eight, sixteen. So we're gonna have sixteen, eighteen over here, minus two. So sixteen more crop plots. Can we make sixteen more crop plots? Uh, plot, blah, blah. Sixteen. No, we can only make nine, and then we're in combat. Anyway, I'm going to finish this off. We're going to have a hard time with the cementing paste, so um, it's going to take a while to make. But overall, I think we have everything irrigated. We can hide all the pipes once we're done, and then all we have is these water filters up, here, up top here, which is absolutely fantastic, and we can even jump up to drink from them. But anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you like the design. I hope you're going to enjoy uh, where this greenhouse is, and that it is so high up should hopefully not be a problem. But let me know in the comments what you think. I'm all always ears and I'm always open to change things around but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did remember to kick that like button in the balls and I hope I see you guys in the next episode and if you're new to the cha channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time until then as always feel spaß and happy gaming okay we have a little bit of fertilizer and we have some seeds so we can try this out I never really did farming before so I don't know what to expect but I'm assuming okay we fertilize that how much did we use? Oh, a little bit. Okay, so deposit fertilizer. Very good. Do we do more? Oh, okay. 
Oh, look at that. Up to 30 we can put in there. Oh, there's poo. So let me see here. Okay. I don't know how long it takes um, for them to use it all up. But what we're going to test is... Ah, your balls. I ate this stupid seed. Everything I have in my inventory, I keep pressing E. Why is E the button for everything? I mean, why is E just literally everything? And then the one time you need it to be something different, you press and it's the wrong bloody button. Ah, <sighs> okay, so. Place this in. Is that what we do? It's seeded. It doesn't have a greenhouse effect yet because we obviously haven't finished the greenhouse. Oh, look. This is pretty awesome. Plant species C seed. And it's using fertilizer now. That is awesome. And I don't think we're going to fit anything else in there. Now let's see how many we fit in here. Um, All five. Let's put all five seeds in here. It's seeded. It's only one though. Can we fit another one in? Oh my lord. It's only one. So if we can put these into small ones, then it might actually make more sense to put them into small ones. Can be planted into small, medium or large. Because if one can only ever be put in, that's just such a waste of space. That's much better. Look at that. Nice. So in this case, fertilizer, 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 and it should be all watered in a second because that water does reach everything. Come on. Irrigated, not irrigated. Come on. 